And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you is live action from the Liga Portugal. It's Boavista up against Benfica. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, it's a flat 4-5-1, which would suggest they're going to try and play on the counter-attack. However, that will only work if they don't drop too deep and can't support the main striker. And this is how the starting 11 looks for Benfica. Joao Mario starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And the game begins. Cabral, strong but fair tackle. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Options in the centre. Can he do it? And a fine stop. Playing it in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Now, what can they do from here? Got a pass that lacks quality. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. And continues his run. Well, they couldn't keep it. And giving the ball away. A move of promise on the flank. Yusufa Nji. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. G. Wasted possession again. Yusufa G. Ramos. A very timely interception. Yusufa Nji. Interception to snuff out the danger. Can they forge ahead? Well, last gas defending, but brilliant defending. Cabral. Nicely cut out. 
Perez. Di Maria. And he stopped them in their tracks. And teammates around him. Rafa. A really intense pressure applied. Surely! And a goal! 1 0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. The managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. And so the match is underway. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Rafa. And he takes it away. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Well, as you can see, Benfica haven't enjoyed the majority of possession, have they? But they've certainly shown an ability. Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. And the keeper stretched penalty in the opinion of the referee. And this is seriously getting away from them. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. And a chance for 2-0. And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Given away by Benfica. G. Gives it a go. And the keeper there to deal with it. Here it is now, a substitution. Can someone get on the end of this? And he clears the danger. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. In with a chance!
Oh, he's given the ball away. Foul there. Free kick awarded. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And he read it well defensively. Perez. Yusufa G. Well, approaching full time, and this is wearing the look of Mission Impossible for the home side, Stuart. Well, they've been second best, that's for sure. And the main problem has been in midfield, where they've been overrun at times. They just haven't been able to get enough possession. It's not been a good performance today. Straight offside, but only just. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Joao Mario. Grimaldo and here's Joao Mario and a crucial intervention inside the box taking care of business defensively here and that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positive, Stuart. Well, he certainly had an impact on the result, not least from 12 yards. He always looked confident, though. We just didn't expect him to miss. And now they get the ball rolling. And a fine stop. Rafa. A really intense pressure applied. Surely. And a goal! 1-0 it is! They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it! And a chance for 2-0. And the penalty is converted! I don't think anyone really questioned him. Gives it a go! And the keeper there to deal with it. Here it is now, a substitution.